about to be called forward onto the course. Sturdes on his steps. They're taking one more turn. Eight to 15, Captain Conan. 11 to four, Hinterland. Nine to one, third intention near the off. 13 fences uh, they'll have to jump here. Open ditches will be two and six. The water, number seven. As I think they're heading out on towards uh, the track. They are indeed. So coming forward now to face the tapes. In line, they're off. A race away uh, with escort men, the last of the five uh, to begin. 13 obstacles, plain fence number one, uh, with odds on favorite Captain Conan in front at it. To act of Kalanisi in second place, they all took it safely. Second is uh, the first of two open ditches on the way round. And a couple of length lead for Barry Geraghty in the pink jacket on Captain Conan as they come to this open ditch. On the right is act of Kalanisi, hinterland in fourth and also really third intention in third place so weren't uh, that clever at it and escort men Dave Cross in the check jacket of black and yellow uh, is the back marker of the quintet in this Markle insurance Henry VIII novices third fence will be downhill on the side of the course it's a plain obstacle and they're well over a uh, furlong away from it now as they come to the end of the home straight so it is Captain Conan, the odds-on favourite after his uh, debut and success at Cheltenham last time, leads to Act of Kalanisi, light blue colours, Richard Johnson, running in second place. A green jacket of third intention, Joe Tizard, two or three lengths further back in third position. And then uh, the one four-year-old, Hinterland, Ruby Walsh, pink jacket, purple spots, runs in fourth place. And escort men, Dave Cross, in the black and yellow checks, is still at the rear of the field five runners as they come down to fence number three, Captain Conan uh, over it okay, they all took it all right and so uh, right handed now to the famous Sandown back straight, seven fences to take here, the middle of them is the water, the third of them uh, is an open ditch and the last three are the famous railway fences, three plain fences that come up in very quick succession so a real big test. Captain Conan at the first of them is over safely, they all jumped it really well, plain fence coming up, three length lead to act of Kalanisi for Captain Conan who shortened into it but was clever Hinterland jumped it slightly better than third intention and closed on him in third position as they come to the second and final open ditch the leading quartet are all safe and escort men was over in last position they run down to the water jump then there's now 15 lengths between first and last the advantage continues with Captain Conan at the water jump number seven of the 13 only narrowly in front there to act of Kalanisi in the light blue on the right a green jacket of third intention and then hinterland and behind those escort men the three railway fences coming up now captain conan comes to the first he was only a very slender leader there uh, to act of kalanisi is almost level with him at the second of the railways third intention behind them three or four lengths away then hinterland then escort men the last of the railways now captain conan asked for a good leap got over it safely still by around about a length as they have three to jump now so they're on their way to home Act of Kalanisi has been in close contact with the odds on favourite for the last half mile or so. Hinterland has eased through into third position. Ruby Walsh now five lengths off the leader. Then third intention who now comes under pressure in, th in fourth position. Escort men is about seven lengths behind him. Pond fence coming up. Three plain fences from here to the line. Captain Conan leading. Active Kalanisi on the extreme right. Just niggled out a little bit. Hinterland is still getting closer. Big leap from Captain Conan at the pond fence. Touchdown by two lengths. Geraghty looks round. He's got active Kalanisi cooked. Hinterland, though, is still to be produced with his challenge. And he's still going all right. Second last. Captain Conan by two to three lengths. Hinterland has moved into second. But Captain Conan has quickened in front and he leads by four lengths as they come to the final obstacle then. Captain Conan out in front at the last, over it safely. Hinterland brushed through the top in second place. He's four or five lengths behind. Active Kalanisi is in third, but pressed by third intention. Captain Conan made all, and it's Barry Geraghty and Captain Conan who weren't really seriously challenged. Hinterland in second. Third intention grabs their position near the line from Active Kalanisi. Thank you.
a dress rehearsal perhaps for what's about to unfold later in the afternoon. Geraghty and Henderson beat Walsh and Nichols. The big guns coming to the fore, but Captain Conan comfortably disposing of the patiently ridden hinterland, who did settle much better today. Barry 